Mm -hmm. Alright everybody, so welcome to another episode of Splatoon 3. Well I say another episode, this is the second part, obviously of using the splat roller. Of course obviously I like to keep it separate, um, where I'll just play a couple of games uh, each. So obviously I've already done a video of the splat roller on the turf war. And yeah, it was pretty successful actually. I've, as I say, I've always liked the splat roller in it, and I have a lot of fun with it. When Lauren started using it as well, she was... It was her favourite weapon for a while. Now obviously she's moved on to the slosher, so I'm kind of intrigued because I've never really used the slosher. I've never really used a lot of the weapons here. Um. I mean, even in Splatoon 2, I, I did, I switched around often, which is, which is probably why I'm going through them all again now and making these videos. I just kind of want to play about with all the different weapons that are available to me. At least then I can fully make a decision um, about which one I kind of prefer. I mean, I know roughly, briefly... What would what might work and what might not. Um, but obviously, I've seen a lot of forums where you know Splatoon 3 is very very so it's very competitive online now, which it wasn't always. No, no, maybe it were, but it's a lot lot more competitive than what it were. I'll, I'll put it that way. So that being said, I think the reason why I'm kind of also doing these videos because I'm not the best gamer out there. I, you know, I, I wish I could be into the whole competitive thing, but I think I kind of stopped playing online for a good while because I was kind of like, I always felt guilty for playing online. Because I'm thinking, why am I playing this when I've got loads of single player games to do? But, to be honest, once upon a time, back when I were playing a lot online, um, I did, re I, it is, though, it's always down to practice, it usually is, and it's no exception with this, it's just nothing but practice, and I think that's what it is, maybe, I'm hoping that, I'm hoping that, um, oh dear, if people see me playing rubbish, those, you know, don't, don't play the game to win, because there's a lot of people where they say, they're always getting splattered, they're always getting, not having a fun time, but I like, well, don't play it to win, just play it to have fun, you know, that's what games are for, oh my god. <laughs> So maybe this is what I, why I'm trying to do these videos because you can see here, you know, I would say just as a slight difference, where's the fun in watching somebody that's dominating the game all the time? Just players, you know, watch this video just as somebody that actually is not the best at the game. Where are I going with this? Yeah, basically there's a lot of people that have said they're ready to give up on the game, but it's so hard, I'm like, well, yeah, just have fun with it, just play the game. I'm rubbish, but I don't play it just to win all the time. Yes, it can be so frustrating, but take it as a learning thing that you want to get better. Oh. I can admit that maybe... This is why Lauren craps like the slosher because I'm hoping it'll be good in situations like that. Like somebody? Wow! That's the slosher. It's a great way of getting to the tower. I will admit the. Uh... Oh, I'm not doing very well with the emotions here. The emotions from that. We've got a lot of ground to cover before we get back there. 
I have a leg on a takeover again soon, see? Oh, I thought I got him. I don't think we're gonna get past that. I do believe. Oh well, I got him. Went over. It didn't last very long, but I got him. At least I took control of the tower again. But we got a lot of ground to cover, and I really don't think we're gonna get to that. Uh, Fast bear and country. Still took the tower though. I'm happy. At least it's not a complete victory. Well, not yet, but. So long as you can like aim it at the tower itself, you know, like when you whack and you splat, it don't seem that bad. And as I say, I seem to get to the tower pretty quickly because of that. I mean, you can get, you know, when you're not worried about ink and turf, you could probably get there pretty quickly anyway. And um, hey ho, doesn't matter. Let's do another quick game of tower control. Oh, stretchy. You know, I was a, I just before this video started. Oh. Ugh. Yeah, before this video started, I was about to make a brew. Oh, I had a panic attack because I moved one cup. I didn't realize the other cup was like balancing on top. And then all of a sudden, like all the cups start to fall and I'm like, uh oh. That was a bit of a panic. And thankfully, none of the smashed. So, yeah, it was very, very close. I was very, very lucky in it. And I'm kind of glad about that as well because one of the cups we have was like a, a really nice, like, clear cup. And I I think it's like perfect for a morning brew to be honest. I mean what time is it at the moment? It is 10 past 11 at the moment so I am too like a cup of tea. But obviously I thought I may as well just have a quick couple of quick games with this and then we'll see. I'm, I'm trying to make most of the time at the moment because as I say I'm over at my house at the moment and Lauren and Lucy are both asleep so so why not? Let's get a little bit of Splatoon in. See, that's obviously another reason as well. You know, I wish I had all the time in the world to practice, but when we're going on days out and everything with family, you don't always have the time to play it. So I don't play pro. It's I'm very much a casual player in that respect. I wish I had the time to practice and dedicate, but sadly I don't, so... You kind of just make the most of what you got. Why am I running and it's coming from there? That was silly, I got a bit distracted. Right Oh well, at least we've got somebody on our team that's next to it. Let's have not have them take over. We don't want this to take the time. Oh well, let's block it then. Oh wow. I'm gonna see, I wanna try and put up more of a fire. No, I got, I got lucky there. No, I don't want to take the power. Even though they've taken the power, but they 
keep control of it. I don't want to keep control of it. I think the moment I seem to get every get onto the tower, it's like I'm bombarded with all black bombs. Oh well, at least I stopped him. This is a... We're always on it! Why? How are they always on it? Oh no, I wasn't dominated. So much for keeping control of the tower. Ooh. Okay. Let's say we'll have one more goal. Fingers crossed we do a little bit better in the third one. Let's see if I can redeem myself on it. I think I'll have to challenge myself in situation here. It, three... Three rules. I'm seeing those points go down. <laughs> three points. Three strikes. I feel like if I give myself... Yeah, maybe I should do something like that. Just as a sort of self-motivation, maybe I need to reward myself with something. I get three chances to at least win one, and then I get a reward of some kind. I don't know. I don't know what I'll do. I've thought about that, because obviously in some of the other videos, I'll, well, one other video at the moment, I did the one life, one hand challenge. I kind of feel like I should be challenging myself in this situation where I give myself three opportunities to win a game. <laughs> and if I fail, uh, is there a penalty? Or maybe if I just win, I should reward myself in some way. I mean, obviously, I don't know. It's... It is very challenging, I will admit now, to remember to do commentary, as well as um, play the game. Why is that not going up? No, I don't think so. No. So... There is the power. <laughs> Yeah. Oh no, I fell off the tower. I fell off the tower. And I got splattered. I can't get back on the tower. Oh no! I not even got me there. The only problem is that whenever I seem to get on the tower like that, maybe it's just my luck that I get splashed between them there. But, unfortunately, I'd love to be able to be throwing bombs at others whilst I'm on the tower, but sadly with this one, it seems like the special bomb that comes with it is the curler, which is no good. Because it's like if you just throw all the sound up. Mm. I fear this is going to be another. It's 
getting closer, ever, ever closer. Oh, serious, yeah. This is not going down well. I don't think I'm gonna win this one this time. <laughs> which which makes this another, another fail. Yes, I think it's definitely correct that I think from now on I should just say um, I failed for two and three. Because there are many people where you want to watch them play and then they'll be obsessed with dominating it. But I'll be honest. Oh no, that made me fall off. It's very rare. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying then. <laughs> yes, you watch me fail all the time at Splatoon 3 because I am doing poo poo at it. Oh my god, it didn't even steamroll in there. And it's slowly on its way back. We didn't even get to the first checkpoint. Fantastic. Maybe it's because everybody's trying to jump to the tower. Maybe I should be distracting people and actually getting people around. Because my instinct is obviously to just go up to the tower, but I think unfortunately everybody else seems to have got the same idea. We took the tower, we, we, we did take the tower. Maybe I should try and stop the people and let the people take the tower. Because, I mean, I am seeing a lot of people there. Um, they don't stay on it, they just try and get people around and defend in it. Oh dear. Well, I feel like I'm going to learn a little bit more each time. I'm going to get myself good at uh, Splatoon 3 again. I say again, I mean obviously from Splatoon 2. I'm going to get myself used to it. So. If you're not watching me dominating, which you're not, fingers crossed you're watching me get more experience <laughs> and you can learn along with me as you watch my points go down every time. So Splat Roller is kind of hard with Tower Control. I, I admit I struggled with that. That seems to be definite, definitely one for like a slosher. Say maybe like the splat charger, or fact, just anything that fires, just not a splat roller. I just don't think know if it worked with that. Um, I'm gonna leave it with the splat roller for now. Good for turf wheel, not for that. So yeah. Hopefully you'll actually watch me get a little bit better by the end of all this. I'm I'm obviously whether I get round to doing it or not because. I don't know, just obviously with time constraints and you know I do a full time job as well as have a family so I don't have all the time in the world to dedicate every hour playing Spell 2 3 as much as I would love to. Um, but yeah instead you can learn with me and see if I get any better by the end of it. Uh, I'm aiming to sort of practice with each weapon and just go with that so obviously if you're new to the channel uh, smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, as the cool say, as the cool say, as the cool kids say, and don't smash your computer. I will leave this video here, and until guys, until guys, oh my god, it is morning. I really need that cup of tea now. I think I'm gonna go make it now. Um, until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.